In this clip, we will learn how to build a RAG tool with Llama 3 and Langchain. We will build it with Python and a few other libraries in just 43 lines of code. This including the imports. The tool will be able to scrape web pages and extract the contents from there. RAG, or Retrieval Augmented Generation, enables you to combine the power of large language models with proprietary knowledge. You feed the LLM documents that are not used to train it, and you make it aware of the knowledge base inside those documents. For organizations, this technique allows them to create chatbots that can answer questions about internal processes and documents. Let's dive right in and see how we can build such a tool. First, you need to have Olama installed. Go to their website, download their software, and install it. If the installation is successful, you can see its icon in the system tray here. Another prerequisite we need to sort out is the set of libraries we need for this tool. You can install everything by running the following command. This will install all the dependencies used in this script. Now let's see the code. We are going to use Streamlit for the UI. With Streamlit, you can generate easy UIs using few lines of code. Here's how we can define the title of the page, as well as a small header below it. We are going to name it Chat with a Web Page. Then, we are going to store the URL of the web page inputted by the user. Then, we make sure the URL is not empty, and after that we load the web page, extract the information out of it, and create an Olama embeddings object. We pass the argument for the Llama 3 model. We first need to download this model through Olama, and in order to do this, you just need to open a terminal and run this command. Olama run Llama 3. This will download the model, and you will be able to use it in the RAG tool. We then create a vector store to efficiently save all the information from the web page. Then, we define the function to handle the user queries. We send the user query to the LLM to get the response. We create a retriever object, which is going to be used to retrieve information from the vector store. We then create another function to combine the documents together, meaning the information stored in the newly created vector store. After that, we create the ragchain function to use the retriever to extract information relevant to the user's question from the vector store. Finally, we store the prompt from the user, we get the information through the ragchain function, and we display it on the screen using Streamlit. Now let's see a demo of it. I am going to use my personal LinkedIn page as an example. I am going to input it here, and then write a question about myself. After waiting a few seconds or minutes, Depending on how powerful your setup is, we get a response. And we see clearly that it managed to reference the supplied LinkedIn page, as otherwise the Llama model wouldn't know anything about me. This shows how powerful RAG tools are. In a few lines of code, we combine an excellent large language model with proprietary knowledge, enabling us to interact with our documents in a fun and easy manner.